I have here a leather watch band, and I went online the other day looking for some answers about what's the best oil to condition leather. And I got some surprising results. Some people said grapeseed oil, uh, olive oil, and of course you can buy specialty products to, to condition leather that are uh, expensive, but they of course work and, and are formulated for that purpose. I want to point some things out as far as what to put on leather. You should never put something like grapeseed oil or olive oil or really any kind of food oil on leather. And the reason is because these kinds of oils, these are triglyceride oils, they turn rancid. And what that means is they break down chemically. So even though people online say you should put olive oil on leather, you should not. And it, olive oil is wonderful, it tastes great, but it's not for leather because of the reason that it can break down and damage the leather. Now, coconut oil, this is fractionated coconut oil, is a step in the right direction. This is also a triglyceride oil, but it's much more resistant to oxidation. In other words, it doesn't go rancid the way that, say, grapeseed oil would. So this is a better choice. It's, it's still not quite the best choice. Now, there's some things you could add to it that would help. For example, this is beeswax. It's great stuff, and you would just melt the beeswax into the into the uh, coconut oil. You also have carnauba wax that can be melted into the coconut oil. If you're melting oils, you, you need to be very aware of not spilling it or causing a fire. Um, and doing that, mixing the coconut oil with the beeswax would give something like this, just a uh, almost like a bomb that could be used. Now, you could also use mineral oil and mineral oil is good it's 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 actually much closer to what you would want now some people have an aversion mineral oil is not from minerals it's petroleum and some people don't like that now this is petroleum jelly i would i would use this instead of mineral oil just because it's heavier so this is like mineral oil it's petroleum but it's heavier and you could certainly use this so this is a good choice and you can mix this, you can melt the beeswax into this to make it thicker and more substantive so it sticks better to the leather. So we're moving in the right direction. Now, my favorite choice for leather is castor oil. Now, castor oil is also a triglyceride oil, but it, but it does not go rancid. This is actually really old, and it... I've never seen castor oil go bad. I'm sure it does at some point, but it's very resistant to oxidation, rancidity. It is also somewhat sticky and, and shiny and just does a really nice job. Now, what you would do is just put it on a piece of paper towel and just rub it in. You could use your fingers. It's not toxic in any way. It's actually good for your skin. Um, it has... A lot of people have heard of it, but they don't really know what it's used for. They think of a laxative, and yes, it is a laxative if you drink drink it. But uh, it is a great conditioning oil in general. Doesn't break down, lasts a long time. So this is my first choice: simple, easy, cheap. Second choice, and you could mix some things if you want to get fancy. So those are my recommendations, and you should not use something like this on leather.